You can also utilize the music and sound effects from the music and sound effects library inside of Microsoft Clipchamp. So to do that, you can go around onto the left side and you can see that music and SFX is an option. SFX stands for sound effects. You can go around and filter out music by clicking on music on the top or by clicking SFX right here to uh, filter out SFX or sound effects. You can go around over here and search for uh, different audios that you want as well. For example, uh, let's say I want an audio related to click, then you can just go around and type in click and search and many different audios pop up as you can see right here. Talking about audio right here, not all of them are free to use. So you can see that there's free to use audios, but the one with the diamond as you can see right here is uh, what you can access only after you upgrade your uh, uh, Clipchamp application. But I'm just going to go around and utilize a free one for uh, uh, for this video right here. Let me just go around onto SFX and over here you can see that there's crowd with happy new year right here and there's like uh, so forth as you can see right here. If you want to preview it, you can press the play button. So that is what you have as you can see. So you can just go around and uh, bring the audio right here by clicking on add to timeline. So once you do that, this is what you have as you can see right here. And if I were to press the play button, Happy New Year! that is what you have as you can see. And it also transcribed it because I had my transcribe turned on. You can go around and bring in different musics as well. Like there's someone uh, somewhere in the mountain. That's the uh, uh, audio as you can see. You can press add to timeline right here just like this and drag it in the beginning. And if you were to go around and press the play button right here after it is loaded. So that is what you have and I'm just going to go around and align it right here. So that is what you have as you can see right here. You can go around and work around with this audio adjust out its volume and then change it out according to how you like just as with any other audio and that is how you can utilize the music and sfx or sound effects library inside of microsoft clipchamp so hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe <laughs>